Welcome back to OCF. Uh, it had to be done, guys. It had to be done. Because GF likes having fun, man. By the way, if you don't know why I've done this, you, you don't know NFL football. But for those of you that know, it's NFL Week 14, the recap. We're still basking in the Cowboys' big victory, but I got to do something for a, uh, a franchise that's had our number, but they suck. They suck recently. And even with uh, this uh, newfound phenomenon of a player, but we'll, we'll, we'll save him for last. It ain't going to end well for the Giants. But Steelers and Patriots Thursday nighter. Nobody cares. Ezekiel Elliott, another great game when he gets the carries against the top five defense. I just keep being right, guys. I don't know what to tell you. Um, Jets at Texans, 30 to 6. Nobody cares. CJ Stroud got hurt. CJ Stroud's a rookie. He's going to be up and down. All this MVP, stop it. They're probably not going to make the playoffs. Let the kid develop. Oh, and what's his name? Had a good game. Zach Wilson. Well, when you, anyone can have a good game out of every five, so good for you. Ravens, 37 31 in over, overtime over the Rams. The Rams are shit. They're a shell of what they used to be. Good for. Uh, Good for Lamar Jackson. He's got the weapons, and um, hey, man, that's um, they're going to be a tough out. I I think they're my Super Bowl uh, favorite coming out of the AFC. Twenty eight six Saints over Panthers. Nobody cares. Panthers stink. Buccaneers 29-25 over the Falcons. They're about three way tie for what six and seven. Man, they're going to get their asses blown off. Uh, you know that wild card game. Shit division. Tired of talking about it. As we get down the stretch here, you're most GF. You got to be great like me. I don't got time for this fucking shit. Bengals, 34-14 to 14 over the Colts. Nobody cares. Shout out to the backup of Browning. The Colts are a mess. Anyway. <coughs> Bears. 28-13 over the Lions. That's why I can't trust the Lions. You're, you're the fourth best team in the NFC, but losing to the Bears, that, that, that's embarrassing. Browns and Jags, 31-27. Browns. With Joe Flacco, Trevor Lawrence, you're tier two, brother. Until I see you pick it up, I'm not saying you're playing awful, but the way you were talked about, Peyton Manning to Andrew Luck to you, your ass hasn't delivered yet, man. I'm personally disappointed in you. I know you'll be tier one eventually, but you didn't get there. You didn't get there on my schedule, so go fuck yourself. No, no, no. Trevor Lawrence is battling some injuries. He gutted it out. He kept the streak going, but he's got to be better, period. The Niners and the Seahawks. Hey, Brock Purdy, man. MVP candidate, Christian McCaffrey. 28-16, they keep rolling. What did I tell you guys about the Seahawks? That's why I told you it wasn't a big victory for Dallas. Seahawks are reeling. It was a nice little start. Average, below average, shit team. I don't want to hear it. Vikings and Raiders, 3-0 in a modern stadium, indoors, dome. I don't care if it's Aiden O'Connell and fucking Dobbs. By the way, Dobbs... 15 minutes of fame, Charlie Villanueva. Hey, man, at least you got no hair on you, man. Josh Dobbs, back to Tier 3, brother. Broncos and Chargers, 24-7. Chargers stink. They can't get anything done. Um, I feel vindicated as a Cowboy fan. Mike McCarthy, we won. Kellen Moore and the Chargers take the L. Terrible, man. Okay, we're getting there. We're getting there. Let's get a couple games out of the way here. Titans and Dolphins, yada, yada. Dolphins always blowing... Blow, blow another game, 28-27. Tua, Tua's not clutch enough. So, Tua, MVP, no. No, no, no. That's above him. What are you talking about here, man? Doesn't come through enough of the clutch. Stupid runner. He's still a stupid runner. I know you're a warrior, Samoan man, a Polynesian. Much love and respect. You're being dumb right now. Get the fuck down. My knee sways as much as you. Get down. You're not that tough. Come on, man. Brock Purdy. You're the left-handed Brock Purdy. You're soft, you're small, you give it everything you have, but Brock Purdy's smart enough to know. Get the fuck down, slide, get out of bounds. Tua, you don't do that, you'll be calling games on CBS or wherever the fuck it is. So, and I don't want that. Bills and Chiefs. Bills and Chiefs. I should have left this one for last, but I, again. 20 or 17 Bills. Josh Allen, put those hands up, because you've indicated me. What did I tell all you morons that are doubting me? That's, that's okay. Doubting me is great. I'm, I'm a Michael Jordan guy. Add logs to the fire. You'll keep taking the L's. SF, dub. I'll keep taking the dubs. Look, sometimes it's going to be a defensive battle. That's just how it is. But let's take this fucking hat off for a second. 
It's going to be a defensive battle. It comes down to Mahomes versus Allen. Yeah, Mahomes, they screwed him with the weapons and all that. We get it. But it comes down to quarterback versus quarterback. He made the plays. Got in position for a field goal. I thought, oh, they're going to blow it again. Kadarius Tony, that much offside, you know? And they might have blown it. What an all-time great play by Travis Kelsey under the circumstances. But Kadarius Tony, you've been a giant fuck-up all year. But either way, kudos to Josh Allen. People who don't believe in Josh Allen, you're fucked, man. Yeah, is he a little erratic with the throws and everything? This guy's the better Cam Newton. He has put the Buffalo Bills on the map. That's hard to do. And they got a big one against Dallas. Let's see what's going on with that. But anyway. And finally, and in closing, the Monday Nighter. There were two Monday Nighters, but the one everyone's talking about, the one that made me, uh, I, I've never, I've, I haven't missed a, a Sunday since 1994. Very proud of that. And I know the history of the league. I've watched everything even before that. Every big championship game, Super Bowls. I know it from Super Bowl one to now. Even before that, I know my history. I love football. American football. I'm Canadian. Shout out CFL. But hey, man. That's like a bang of six out of ten. I got to go, man. I got to go higher, man. It is what it is. We're all on different levels. So. Yeah, I know. I love me some me. What are you going to do? I'm a terrible ones guy. But I'm not a narcissist. No, no, no. I run my own charity. You can't be that way. So anyway. Let's close it out, GF. Let's close it out in style. 24-22 Giants over Packers. Wow. Uh, Tommy DeVito. The phenomenon that, 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 that is. Tommy DeVito. 17 for 21. Only 150 yards in the TD, but bailed out Saquon. I told you guys Saquon's overrated. Another bad fumble. Not saying he's not a star running back. He is, but for what he was supposed to be, my goodness. Just not getting it done. It's also not a bad team, but still. You got to be individually great. Sometimes I haven't seen enough of it from him. Tommy DeVito, his parents, his WAP GWID agent, who apparently he's been an agent in the NFL, did some research on it. Got to love it. Making cutlets for people, Italian food, our tradition, our culture. I'm not saying we're the best. No one's the best, but uh, I'll let a reputation. I'll, I'll let it right out. Yes, there's some... Negative stuff, the mob, the racism, well, hey, you know, GF smashes black women, Asian, I, I, I love everyone, man, most Italians do, but we get a bad rep, some of these uh, movies and stuff, but either way, I think it's a feel-good story, it shows what we're all about, family, friends, faith, eh, smack a couple asses here and there, we like big titties, but either way, Tommy DeVito, I'm a, I hate the Giants, I'm a diehard cowboy fan, but as a Italian descendant myself, uh, I hope you take the job over Daniel Jones, Daniel Jones is ugly, man. Dumb and dumber face. This kid makes what? Peanuts. I'd rather the 40 million, but they're stuck with him. So either way, Tommy DeVito, I salute you, brother. Uh, you only lost to Dallas. I think you've been undefeated ever since. There goes the hat. But you know what, man? You're ma oh, everything's going here, man. You're making the, uh, the Italian uh, contingency proud. You're making Giants fans proud. You're probably not going anywhere. Maybe you're flash the pan story. We don't know what it is, but... Hey, man, in the NFL, you've had your little 15 minutes of fame here, and uh, I salute you, brother. But go Cowboys.